I wanted somewhere with a smaller intake where I could really get to know everyone in the firm and that really was the case at Phil Fisher when I came to do my back scheme. So the reason I applied to Phil Fisher specifically was because of the strong focus in the area of technology. Um, just looking sort of forwards in my career, I really wanted to become a technology lawyer and I felt like this was the best place to start my career at. So when I decided to move to London, I wanted it to be for a job that I really wanted and to work for a firm that I really wanted to work for and Phil Fisher fulfil both of those. So every day is different. It can range from pure contractual reviews to research tasks to preparing for training sessions and client meetings. Uh, pretty busy, so it changes up day to day. So first thing I sort of do when I come in in the morning is log on, check my emails and see what's come in. And based upon that, I can have a think about what's going on uh, in my department and make a sort of good to-do list for the day to see where my priorities need to be. Get in the morning, check your inbox, see what's happened, but you can be doing anything from drafting to sitting down with partners about an upcoming project, maybe helping them with some business development work. There'd be lots of court deadlines, um, so it was go, go, go on all these different matters, t talking to the other side on, on, a, on a case. But that would always end at 4, 4.30 when the courts close. So at that point, you could just properly relax. I'd be in contact with clients about matters, uh, drafting some court documents for an upcoming litigation, just stuff that I've not really done before and I was a bit stressed about, but just receiving good feedback along the way from both clients and the people internally that asked me to do the work was a really great feeling. And just knowing that their trust that they put into me was justified was a really good feeling too. In terms of my seat, it's definitely my secondment to the Silicon Valley office is a highlight of my training contract. I organised for 12 of the trainees to do the Three Peaks Challenge uh, in June last year. It was really fun and we raised, I think, about £11,000 in the end, so it was a really good fun, um, great weekend. Um, the firm's just launched our Just Purpose scheme, so that's about uh, corporate responsibility and pro bono, so I've been helping out with the Reading Partners scheme. Uh, helping out the Queen Mary's Legal Advice Clinic and raising some money for our new partnership with St Mungo's, which is a charity for homelessness. The co-captain of the Philfish Netball team, so we run that and play in the league on a Monday and I also take part in quite a few pro bono activities and the Philfisher Reading Scheme with a local school.